What is up, you guys? The Dominator Dominic Flores back with you guys here today to do my WWE Fast Lane uh, match card predictions. So yeah, uh, Sunday night is going to be Fast Lane. But before we get into the predictions, go check out uh, this morning's video, which was WWE Weekly Results. So go check that video out. And yeah, um, so Fast Lane this Sunday. Um, so the card looks average um, for a pay per view. Uh, but let me, I'll give you my predictions right now. So we have uh, Becky Lynch and Naomi versus Natalia and Carmella. Uh, I think we are going to have Naomi and uh, Becky Lynch. Now, if you follow me on wrestling, you know, you guys know I love Carmella. She's my favorite women's wrestler. Um, uh, but yeah, I really like Carmella, but I'll get into what the rumors are saying and what I think might happen. Um, so, yeah, uh, my prediction is Becky and Naomi to win. Uh, then we had, I kind of saw this coming because, I mean, we had Shinsuke Nakamura versus Aiden English last week on SmackDown. So, I kind of figured Rusev would challenge uh, Shinsuke since Shinsuke needs to look strong before Mania, doesn't have an opponent. Why not throw him against Rusev and have Rusev job out? <laughs> so, yeah, we'll see Shinsuke Nakamura versus Rusev. Uh, yeah, obviously Rusev's gonna win, you know, um, yeah, you know, I'm being sarcastic. Uh, Shinsuke's gonna win. Now, this website that I'm looking at, they give their predictions too. They actually think Rusev is gonna win. So, okay, uh, if that's what you guys think. Uh, but I, I think, I'm trying to film here. Uh, I think that, uh, Shinsuke Nakamura will defeat Rusev so he can look strong for WrestleMania. And then we have Bobby Roode, the United States champion, uh, versus Randy Orton. Now, what I think is going to happen is they're going to be in the middle of the match, and then here comes Jinder Mahal, interferes in the match, and then um, he's like, I want my title shot. I am the modern-day Maharaja. Um, so, yeah, I think that's what's going to happen. And then Daniel Bryan's going to come out, he's like, because he's supporting the heels uh, a lot lately. So I'm sure he's going to come out and he's going to say, All right, well, we're going to have Jinder Mahal versus Randy Orton versus Bobby Roode for the United States Championship. Restart the match. Ding, ding, ding. Excuse me. Uh, ding, ding, ding. And then I think Bobby Roode is still going to retain. I mean, his United States title run has been mediocre. Uh, nothing, like, uh, amazing or special. <laughs> But um, I'm going to have uh, Bobby Roode as my prediction to win the uh, retain the United States title. Moving on, we will have Ruby Riot versus Charlotte Flair. Um, um, so, yeah, we have Ruby Riot versus Charlotte Flair. I don't think Ruby Riot's going to win, uh, honestly. Um I mean, she's a great performer, great heel, um, but, um, yeah, Charlotte is going to defeat Ruby Riot, is what I'm going to say, uh, and retain her title to go to WrestleMania, but what I think is going to happen is I think Carmella, I hate to say this, I think Carmella is going to run in cash in, at least that's what the rumors say, but I also can agree with that. I think she's going to run and cash in, and but she's not going to be successful. Charlotte's going to win. And then here comes Asuka. Na, na, na. I like her theme song. Um, Asuka is going to come out, I think, and she's going to challenge uh, Ruby Riot Or not Ruby Riot, Charlotte Flair uh, at WrestleMania for the WWE SmackDown Women's Championship. So that match should be good. But what do they do with Monday Night Raw? I think you have a triple threat match between Sasha Banks, Bailey, and uh, Alexa Bliss. That would make sense to me. So yeah, um, yeah. Moving on, we have the New Day versus the Usos. Um, very energetic teams. Uh, so yeah, um, this is a hard one. Um, I, love, I think their match is going to be good. I think it could steal the show, possibly. Um, but, yeah, I'm really looking forward to this match. Who do I pick, though? Uh, for the SmackDown Live tag titles. 
I mean, they've already had so many amazing matches. I think they should have made this match a two out of three falls match because this match would have been amazing. But they just did that at the Royal Rumble. So, I'm going to go with the Usos retaining the title because I love their work um, as the, the tag team championship, or with the tag team championship. Um, they're great heels. Um, and I don't know. I just think that I'm leaning more towards the Usos than the New Day to retain the uh, tag team championships. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to go with the Usos. But I think, again, this match is going to blow the roof off this place. Um, and it should be fun. Um, and, yeah, I, I just think the Usos are going to win. Moving on. Come on, load. Alright, here we go. So, uh, the main event for the evening, we will have Baron Corbin versus Kevin Owens versus AJ Styles versus John Cena versus Sami Zayn versus Dolph Ziggler uh, for the WWE Championship. Um, so, yeah. Um, uh, yeah, this isn't like a six-pack challenge or elimination match. It's a fatal six-way, they're probably going to call it, or a six-way match. I don't know what they're going to call it. Um, but, yeah, so I'm going to go by process of elimination and tell you guys who I know is not going to win. Number one, Dolph Ziggler. I, I just don't see him winning. I mean, he's honestly, I think he's always just going to be a mid-card guy. Maybe, just maybe. I mean, their time to push the guy was at the beginning of the brand split when they had uh, both team or uh, both Raw and SmackDown. They still do, but like when it, the opportunity, like opportunity, was an exclamation point for SmackDown. Like they wanted to give stars opportunity. You should have given Dolph Ziggler this opportunity and have him win at SummerSlam against Dean Ambrose. Uh, that was your opportunity. So yeah. Uh, next, Baron Corbin. I don't think they're going to give the title to Baron Corbin. I, I just don't know. Now, as a Kansas City guy, Baron Corbin is a Kansas City guy. I would love to see him win, but you don't want him main event in WrestleMania because he's not an amazing performer. And I don't think uh, he's just all ready for WrestleMania, but definitely a future champ uh, world champion probably in my mind because it seems like WWE really enjoys pushing him. So, yeah. Uh, next, Sami Zayn, the underdog. I should just say it all for you. He's the underdog. Uh, but I'll give you my reason why I don't think Sami Zayn will win. First of all, he won this past, uh, Tuesday on SmackDown Live. So, that usually means, you know, you're probably not gonna win the match. Just like whenever you touch the title and hold it up, that probably means you don't win. But that doesn't necessarily always happen. So, I'm gonna go with, uh... Uh, Sami Zayn definitely not winning. Kevin Owens not winning because I think uh, they are going to have a match. Uh, Kevin Owens will definitely be the WWE Champion one day, at least I hope. Um, I think they're setting up a match, obviously, for Sami Zayn versus Kevin Owens 200 at WrestleMania. <laughs> no. But uh, we've seen that match like eight times when it was supposed to be ending. More than eight times. We've probably seen that match like ten times in the WWE. Um, but their feud was supposed to be ending, but it's, it never ends. But they always put on good matches, so that's a plus. Uh, yeah, and then you have John Cena. John Cena doesn't really need a, a championship going into WrestleMania. Now, we were supposed to get John Cena versus Rey Mysterio. That match could have been good, but uh, uh, Rey Mysterio, unfortunately, has come down with an injury. So he will not be able to, uh, most likely will not be able to go uh, to WrestleMania face John Cena as much as I would love to see that. Um, but hopefully the WWE decides to sign him before he decides to retire. Unless he retires because of this injury. Hopefully not though. Um, hopefully we see Ray back in the ring soon. So that leaves one man. The phenomenal AJ. Styles. Um, yeah, I think AJ Styles is going to retain his WWE Championship because we want to see AJ Styles versus Shinsuke Nakamura at WrestleMania. And the fans would be... Do you 
know how big of an eruption that would be if someone didn't win and we didn't get to see AJ Styles versus Shinsuke Nakamura for the WWE Championship, that'd be worse than Roman Reigns getting booed out of the building at uh, Royal Rumble 2015 WWE. So don't make that mistake, please. I, I know you guys are definitely watching this video, uh, but another piece of sarcasm because they're not watching this video. Um, but yeah. So, I think AJ Styles will retain his title, and we'll see AJ Styles versus Shinsuke Nakamura at WrestleMania. Hopefully, the main event. I don't know. But, thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any suggestions or your predictions, comment down below. If you disagree, comment down below. Tell me what you think the predictions will... or your, Tell me your predictions for this Sunday fast lane. So, yeah. On, on Monday, I will give you my WWE fast lane live results and reactions. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Wrestling, you know, at the Dominus Toy Show. And as always, thank you guys for watching. D-Phone.